fiddle, man. Uh, all right. Hmm. Okay, good. Now, which is this stuff for this one? I think it's this one. No, it's this one. This one. There you go. Okay, turn it on. Oh, he's sticking here. Heavy. Okay, let's do it again. Let's do it up. Like this. Push it in. Push it in. Hold it. Make sure to have your clothes very good for you. It's a cabbage. Put on my gloves again. Smooth that there for me. Only look like I'm touching fire. Yeah. 
boiling in the net. Make sure they don't burn. I think that's red, but I'm not sure. Let's keep on cooking it. Guys, guys. Oh, because the campans will be. Ah, uh, no, no, not this. Okay. Is cut the cabbages into small cheese pieces. I got that. Place the cabbage in a pot of boiling water. Yeah, we did that. Allow it to stay boiling for at least 10 minutes. Yeah, we did that. Then, yeah, Afterwards, allow the mixture to cool. Pour the combination through a coffee filter to retain just the filtered juice. You now have cabbage juice needed to test the household component. Yep, it's been just about 10 minutes. 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Get testing over here. Milk right there, it's the milk. All right, let's get switch. All right. Oh no, I put my cabbage hands all over the milk. No good. No good. Ah, I bet I must smell that cabbage tomorrow. I just know it. Okay, guys. Now this is in, okay? Watch carefully. All right. Put some indicator. It became as uh, this like liquid blue, but it just looks like a discoloration. We are going to use this in the okay. Okay. So according to the chart, it's like blue, blue green. This is like a blue green. I give it a. I'll give it. Is this a blue green? This. Do you know what color? Okay. Alright, there we have the milk. Now we're going to dump the milk. Have to wait for some. Oh. My god, what's happening? Okay, let's put that back. Alright, I don't know what color that is. vinegar so we got some vinegar here which I actually never use I'm quite lucky that we need it in this experiment now we have some vinegar okay go to open the vinegar take a sniff oh, shit. <coughs> vinegar no smell that good okay now let's put some vinegar let's pour some <coughs> we got the glass Pour some vinegar in. Okay, we got some nice vinegar. Got some nice vinegar. 
you know it. Was it vinegar? <sighs> Go to pour some of this in. Okay. We put it in and the following color came up. Oh shoot, sorry. Shoo. This is like a red for the strawberries. Okay? I think. Or maybe is that pink? I'm colorblind. Oh. The struggle is real. Oh. Okay. Let's see. We got the this is like a red. Okay, we'll put this on the red. Is there a pink? Gosh, how do these people tell? Okay, this might be like purple red. I'm pretty sure this is red. So this is a vinegar was a good red. 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 Meaning, whoa, what the heck? Oh, yes, yes. That means the vinegar, very acidic. You see? Two on the pH scale means it's not basic. It means it's very acidic. And we know vinegar usually very acidic. Okay? Okay, now we put this paper down, we go, go, we do this. Okay, guys, now we're ready to text the test the next one in our experimentation. Okay, next one, we'll try some baking soda. Today we have some baking powder, baking soda, same thing from like 15 years ago. Don't ask, I never use baking soda in my cooking. Okay, so we can, oh god, this is disgusting. Okay, so we're gonna open it up. I can't even open it. Oh my god, there's actually something in here. Okay. Now we're just gonna put some in. Putting some baking soda in. Okay. I think that's enough for our test right now. What is happening here? It's like changing this color. This is like a purplish substance now. You see that? Look, look closely. On the top it is white, but on the bottom you can see a discoloration, no longer white, and red, maybe like a actually it's like a turquoise blue green now that I see it. Blue green. Okay. God dang it. Okay. Okay, all right, all right, all right, we try, we try. Okay, the uh, next one. We tried milk, vinegar, baking soda, now we have to try liquid plumber, liquid plumber, oh gosh, this is very dangerous, okay. Liquid plumber, liquid plumber is a full clog destroying liquid substance okay it used to take out everything in the way of your bathtub and we're using it here today to clean some stuff okay okay let's open this liquid plumber I'm very afraid I have never done this in my life before oh my it's, it's like it's like right there there's no protection or anything it's gonna pour very little okay very little. I don't want any of these hazardous chemicals to be breathed in. Oh my god, I can already sense it. My gun is going to explode, man. I don't trust this thing one bit. Don't worry, I never use this glass to drink anyway. Okay, we we'll put some liquid plumber back there. Alright, we got the liquid plumber in there. And we're gonna put some of our indicator, the red cabbage, back in. Oh my god, please don't explode. Okay, so oh, whoa, look at this color, it's beautiful. Now, there may be some the color discoloration on my on the camera, but it looks very orange from where I am. This is just because of the lighting on the camera. This is a very bad camera, sorry. It's again, but this is very good. Oh, shoot, is the camera following me? Oh, I think it is. Okay. So this is very good by the way guys, we have actual test solution It seems to be, okay, wait Um, I believe 
that's like a green a green a green so if we check we check the acid base indicator all right or based on a worksheet this is no there's no orange list. this goes to the green yellow meaning this liquid cleaner is very basic on the 12 of the pH okay all right good uh, now we'll have to clean this out I'll be right back this is very dangerous stuff be careful put it in this is great this is great list to read put back original colors like greenish let's see what happens let me put some of our indicator of red cabbage juice in okay put some in okay it's changing color it's changing the color that's the current color we see Ooh, I'm like a human centrifuge okay we oh shoot okay now that we see it it is like purplish just like the the cabbage juice just got a maybe a bit lighter to be honest not much change let's check what the pH of this is all right so the pH of this pH of this one is it's like purple to violet around four to six okay this is, so this is Listerine is acidic okay now we're going to clean this one out okay next step we have to find our sprite okay we have sprite so we got a great can of sprite over here we're going to open it oh I hope that doesn't happen that I think it's good oh wait what if I want to drink the sprite later but I'm using my gloves oh my the struggle is real oh gosh oh well no sprite for me later is this in? doubled and let's see what happened okay so the sprite okay it's because of the light it's a very transparent color this is actually like a purplish color can give it a few seconds actually I believe it's acidic after all H plus is an acid okay I think it's safe to say that this one is actually purplish violet which means it is low on the pH scale which means it's acidic so it's around a 4 to 6 on the pH scale okay alright okay let's go lemon juice We have some lemons. Okay, got the lemon juice. Got a knife. Got the lemon juice. I got the knife. I'm gonna put some lemons. I'm gonna put some more lemons. Oh well, lemons. Okay. This is very easy to dress it. Oh wow, this turned very red. Oh, pink reddish. Okay, 
stir away you. It's like a pink red ish. Which I believe means all the way on the left with pH skill. So as you can see, that means it is very acidic, which makes very sense. Because we know that lemon juice usually is acidic. At least I think. Okay. Put some water into this. Probably should have used tap water, but that's okay. I won't be able to use this anymore. Okay. Let me get some of that indicator. Get in this camera. Okay, camera maybe. This. Okay. Got this. Get some of that indicator in. Okay. I we'll have some over here. We let it slosh and slosh around. Still stand a bit purple. Now note, this is, what is this again, this is, this is water, right, so, as expected, water is basically neutral, uh, basically neutral, no, it's neutral, nothing really happened, so according to this, it is between the middle of violet and blue, which it is, so kudos to you, water, for following your chemical properties you can have all of them open it take out my glass it's not serious no it's not I don't expect anything to happen I just need to keep this orange juice clean I'll get the oranges later so pick this up close again okay close some of that over here sure that's great It's like a reddish color. It's like a red. Fortunately, the camera probably cannot see this. This is like a reddish, light reddish color. I'm gonna put it near the red, so that means orange juice is pretty acidic. All right, good. All right, good. It was acidic, fairly acidic, because it gives us a red indication. Now we're gonna try milk of magnesia, which I believe should be very basic. But let us try out. Okay, we open this milk of magnesia. Oh snap, that is not very seal protected to me. Hey, what can you expect? It's from Walgreens. Okay, so we got the dosage cup. Okay, got our milk of magnesia. What you see, milk of magnesia is a laxative, it's magnesium hydroxide. Oh shoot, it says hydroxide in there. You know what that mean? Hydroxide means it's basic, it says OH minus right in the name. Okay. So we're going to open this. Wish me good luck. Oh, it is temper seal. It has some protection. My god, this is impossible to open. Okay, just gonna. Okay, so got some milk of magnesia. We'll pour some in. Oh god, that looks very basic. Extremely basic. Okay, it's very basic. Alright, and now I have a home supply of milk magnesia. Whoever wants to use that, go ahead, not me. Oh, it's turned like a green, which means it is very basic. Good. Okay, it's actually a green color. I wonder if I turn. Okay. 
All right, we just got that. Now, we just finished the milk of magnesia. Our final one is Coca-Cola. Except it's not our final one, because we're doing extra credit today. All right. So we get, oh, I don't want to mess up Coca-Cola, so I opened the can without my gloves for a second. I'll be right back. Open it. This, my friends, is some Coca Cola. I would like to drink it, but I do not trust this thing. A greenish thread. Oh, what? Okay, it turned like a red, which means it's acidic. Okay, it's turned red. Alright. Okay, so right now, we just, you may not be able to see, fill some dishwashing liquid, originally it is like an orangish color, it's on the bottom, let's we'll see what a little of this can do. Remember, dishwashing liquid is concentrated, but it should still have the reaction. Okay. Mixing it up, mixing it up. This washing liquid seems to be a bit on the clearer end, actually. Oh, sorry. Ooh, I'm a human. Human. What is centrifuge? I'm a human centrifuge. Look at me spin the liquid. Okay. So as we can tell, this is like a darker-ish purple, purplish color. So this washing liquid, this washing liquid is purple violetish. Okay. Okay, now we will test what is this water doing here, okay, we will test some, uh, how do you say, the other stuff now. Okay, now we're going to test some shampoo and conditioner from Pantene. So we open it up, put some in, if it's good enough. Okay, so it's currently like a white color. Like this color. This is shampoo, by the way. It's a very gloppy shampoo. We're going to have to mix it a bit.
Okay, it's just like a little color discretion. It's like a purple, light purple. I'd say it's it's a pretty pretty acidic thing. It's weird. It didn't change to become blue green or anything. Actually, let's let it go for a little while. Okay, so as you can see on the side, it is just about green. But if you um. It's like on the purplish blue violet side, it is acidic. Whoops, that's not good anyway. Okay, we tested two more, which included dishwashing liquid and some shampoo and conditioner. Oh no, I got some on the floor. Excuse me. Okay, now we need a third one that we must test. And it will be... We got shaving cream. There we go, that is enough. Okay, so we test some shaving cream here. It's a foamy substance, foamy substance. We have to see if it's. I don't know. Oh gosh, this is a very odd substance, stirring white, but I think overall on the bottom it is still a purplish, you see in the bottom, oh sorry, so you can see on the bottom it's purplish, the top is just a sharing cream that does not mix, therefore it is acidic, I mean halfway there, it's more basic and neutral, neutral, neutral. Shaving cream leave it sparkly clean. Okay. That is our third one. Now let's look for let's look for something else to test. Just got some shaving cream on the bodies. Oops, there's some shaving cream on the table. Be careful, everybody. Oh, sauces that we never use. Let's see. Oh, okay. All right, we got some sauce. Water, sour, shosh sauce. Okay. Oh, that is a lot. Ok. 
Ok. Watch and say our sauce. All right. So here. Oh man, we are we are just about to hit the limit. Making five more. Okay, starting. Starting brownish, but that's just about the color it stayed. Oh, Add some more of the indicator. Oh, we only have one more solution. I don't waste it. Oh. Okay, what well, just I saw seems to turn red, which means it is acidic. Okay, stunning red, you can't see it really on the camera. However, uh, it turned a bit red. Okay, so now we are here on our last substance. Let's get ready. Let's see what it is. Okay, we got up close and personal and got some baby powder. Let's open some baby powder. Alright, there we go. Whoa! Yeah, okay, we got some baby powder. Right. Baby powder. Don't fail me now. Let's see what color you turn. Okay. So as you can see, the baby powder is being mixed with it. It is staying purplish. Blue. Yes, it is staying purple is blue. If we can see here, this is very purple is blue. It's like a blue greenish. You know, it's like a blue, bluish green. It's bluish green. Okay, and there we have it. We have just tested these solutions. Okay, we've made a big mess. But, okay, let's take a look at the pH scale once again. And this is be 12. That one was a very basic around a 10. Okay. It's actually a green color. I wonder if I turn off lights is a little little special light I have over here. Alright, so this is green. No, I think we should turn on the lights. Okay. This looks green. Let's go back. Okay, alright, we just got that, now, we just finished the milk of magnesia, our final one is coca-cola, except it's not our final one, because we're doing extra credit today, alright, so we get, oh, I don't want to mess up coca-cola, so I open the can without my gloves for a second, I'll be right back.
obviously his is an arch menacing Unfortunately, the scooping show is a point of view thing. You know, to aid in the point of view feeling. <coughs> okay. Should I open the can? Ow. Smells good. I probably shouldn't have wasted that much coke on this. Gonna put this back in the fridge. Let's go back in the fridge. Right. We got some Coca Cola. Alright. Let's put some of our gloves back in on. I'm getting close to 33 minutes. How is this even? Good thing we did this in low quality. So, go back on. This, my friends, is some Coca-Cola. I would like to drink it, but I do not trust this thing. No. Oh, look. I think Coca-Cola will become in a... It changed color a little. Over. I don't believe this is enough. Garbage juice or indicator sauce. Put some more in. Kind of change into a brownish color, but I believe that's was how it was before too. It's like no color changes, taking like a black brownish color. Okay, so it's it's more off to the green yellow side, but how can I really tell? Is this is this is this even wait? Is it purple? More indicator to check. Okay, I, I put nearly the same amount. It is about a like a greenish thread. Oh, what? Okay, it turned like a red, which means it's acidic. Okay, it's so turned red. Okay, so right now, we just, you may not be able to see, fill some dishwashing liquid, originally it is like an orangish color, it's on the bottom, let's we'll see what a little of this can do. Remember, dishwashing liquid is concentrated, but it should still have the reaction. Okay. Mixing it up, mixing it up. This washing liquid seems to be a bit on the clearer end, actually. Oh, sorry. Ooh, I'm a human. Human. What is centrifuge? I'm a human centrifuge. Look at me spin the liquid. Okay. So as we can tell, this is 
like a darker ish purple purplish color so this washing liquid this washing liquid is purple violet ish okay Okay, now we will test what is this water doing here, okay, we will test some, uh, how do you say, the other stuff now. Yeah. Okay, now we're going to test some shampoo and conditioner from Pantene. So we open it up, put some in, if it's good enough. Okay, so it's currently like a white color. Whitish color. This is shampoo, by the way. It's a very gloppy shampoo. We're going to have to mix it a bit. Okay, it's just like a little color discretion. It's like a purple, light purple. I'd say it's it's a pretty pretty acidic thing. It's weird. It didn't change to become blue green or anything. Actually, let's let it go for a little while. Okay, so as you can see on the side, it is just about green. But if you um. Right. It's like on the purplish blue violet side, it is acidic. We got shaving cream! There we go, that is enough. Okay, so we test some shaving cream here. It's a foamy substance, foamy substance, we have to see if it is. Oh no. Oh gosh. This is a very odd substance. Turning white, but I think overall on the bottom it is still a purplish. You see in the bottom. Oh, sorry. As you can see on the bottom it's purplish. The top is just a sheer cream that does not mix. Therefore, it is acidic. I mean, halfway there. It's more basic and neutral. 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 Oh, 
shaving cream leave it sparkly clean. Okay. That is our third one. Now let's look for let's look for something else. To test. We just got some shaving cream on the bodies. Oops, there's some shaving cream on the table. Be careful, everybody. Oh, sauces that we never use. Let's see. Oh, okay. All right, we got some sauce. Water, sire, shosh, sauce. Okay. Oh, that is a lot. Okay. Watch inside our sauce. All right. So here. Oh man, we are we are just about to hit the limit. Making five more. Okay, starting, starting brownish, but that's just about the color it stayed. Oh, some, some more of the indicator. Oh, we only have one more solution. I don't taste it. Oh. Okay, what is our sauce seems to turn red, which means it is acidic. Okay, it's turning red, you can't see it really on the camera. However, it turned a bit red. Okay, so now we are here on our last substance. Let's get ready. Let's see what it is. Okay, we got up close and personal and got some baby powder. Let's open some baby powder. Alright, there we go. Whoa! Yeah, okay, we got some baby powder. Right. Baby powder. Don't fail me now. Let's see what color you turn. Okay. So as you can see, the baby powder is being mixed with it. It is staying purplish. Blue. Yes, it is staying purple is blue. If we can see here, yes, it is very purple is blue. It's like a blue greenish. You know, it's like a blue, bluish green. It's bluish green. Okay, and there we have it. We have just tested these solutions. Okay, we've made a big mess. But, okay, let's take a look at the pH scale once again. And this looks to be a 12. That one was very basic around a 10. Okay.